Hello YouTube. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to get Skyrim for Mac, or actually showing you how to fix the rendering problem. Um, this video right here, Skyrim for Mac download cider wrapper dot mov by I'm a beast in ten. Um, TG, uh, actually shows you how to download Skyrim for your Mac. Um, actually, it's very confusing. Uh, well, sorry, not the video is confusing, but uh, how to fix the rendering problem I had a little troubles with, so I had to do some research, and I'm going to show you how to fix that. So um, this is just to prove that Skyrim um, that Skyrim works for the Mac. Um, it is a little glitchy in full screen, so you're going to want to go Command Enter to play and it brings you out here. Um, also this allows you to get cheat codes without having to exit and enter the game every two seconds. Um, the startup time for the game is a little slow, like the wait time. Uh, this might take a couple minutes so I'm just gonna skip ahead. Okay and we're back. Um, considering I just started up, it will be a little bit laggy, but if you, if you play for a while, it will begin to be fine. Uh, that's just TGM. Uh, there's a bunch of other cheats. I'd suggest going to PC Gamer for your cheats. And once again, this is going to take a little while to get outside. And here we go, outside. Now right when I got off the game, the controls were a little weird. Um, to use your sword, it was um, left to strike, and I've changed it now to block. Oh, and there's my little helper. Um, so anyways, this is what it looks like. Uh, <clears throat> my computer isn't the best, so I don't have my graphics put up all the way. Anyway, so I'm going to show you how to fix that rendering problem. I can just. Uh, to do that, you just hit the F3 key. It doesn't always work. Oh, that's a pain in the ass. One second. Okay, uh, that's not going to work right now. Before you start the game, you do need something loaded. So I'm just going to... Uh, by the way, F5 is quick save. I'd really recommend it whenever you're moving somewhere or you want to do something without actually uh, having to go into your menu and save. Um, this is how you quit. You just go Q, Q, Q three times. No exit out of your game. Okay, to get your rendering problem fixed, because there's been a couple of complaints on the guy's video about that. Uh, you go here, system preferences. Um, it might come up with a couple of things. You just have to go into the Elder Scroll uh, 5 Skyrim folder, not just the Skyrim folder, and then you click the Elder Scroll game that you'll actually be playing on. You open it. And then it will have all this. It's set there, I think, right off the bat. And depending on how laggy it is, it's going to, you're going to have to change it either up or down, depending on your computer. Um, <clears throat> I don't mind the graphics right now. I think they're actually pretty good. So that's how you do that. And then you can go back to playing. Once again, command enter. Oh, I forgot to open something up. Anyways, it doesn't matter. So once again, just proving that this guy's system does work. Um, 
follow directly what it says. Don't try any uh, stupid shortcuts or anything like that. I don't know why you would, but... In magic... Uh, one second. Conjuring a... Uh, yeah, a lot of these don't work either. The conjuring ones, like uh, Command Deja. Um, Conjure Dragon Priest, that one doesn't work either. Uh, the bow is cool, I got to admit. You just hold it for a little, and then you, whoosh, there you go, you got your bow. And just to go back, you just hit, and then you get your sword back, and then you just do it again. And you got your bow. <clears throat> now I'm going to show you how long it takes to travel to a city. I'm going to Martha because I'm trying to retrieve the horn, which you know, you go and then it's not there because that stupid woman takes it before you can get there. There we go. I'm in Martha. Um, when you do go to a new location, like as you can see, it's a bit laggy. It's not great, but it's still Skyrim for Mac, so can't really complain. Anyway, so this is Morthal. I don't remember ever coming here, but <clears throat> whatever. What I really like to do, and probably one of my favorite cheats, is just to go like this. Wait till he's alone, because you can kill yourself by doing this. And that's actually a fair bit of fun. If you're short on cash, which you shouldn't be, because if you can do that, then you can just go player dot. Add item zero 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 seven zeros F and for this you can go anywhere between one and ninety nine so you know oh that did not work maybe I added too many zeros oh no I found it why and up in the top corner. Gold, 90, 999 added. Um, there is a cheat to improve your speed, but I thought, hmm, it's just going to be glitchy. Like, more glitchy than the game already is. I decided against it. So, that's pretty much it against, uh, again, F5 is uh, quick save. As you can see up in the corner, it's quick saving. And you just go boom. Give you a view, and it's done. Thanks for watching.